catch, especially in a street fight, I don't like catching street fight stuff, but in a street fight, you come up, ah, and his hands are, no matter what, any normal kid's hands are going to come up, that's when you drop him. You can go, you can go, flop, flop, and then change, and he's, he's coming down, and then you come back up, bam, and then he comes back up, and you know what I mean? So it's like combinations of stuff. Um, but the next thing that we'll go over is singles. So it's basically the same concept. We're going to pull one way. Pull, see how his legs are coming? So we're going to pull circle right, or circle left, sorry. Circle left, circle left, circle left. His legs are coming. And that's what we want. So we want this leg to come forward. The whole thing is a pull. Once you pull, his leg comes to you, and then we're shooting. So right here, pull. This hand is coming to the outside. This hand is wrapping around. Right here. Head in. We don't want your head to slip out because then he's coming in. Right there. So head in. Okay. What we're going to do is we're going to drive off this foot. Sometimes your lock matters if he's fighting it. Um, I would keep your, keep your bottom hand on top of this. It's getting too technical. So just get your lock. This left leg is going to drive in. And I'm going to push with my head to get his body weight that way. So here, see how I stopped and he went this way, he kept going? That's how I get away from being stuck down here. This is, this is okay. We can still score from here. We can still take it down. So when we do get here, can we push? Come up. Okay. So again, we'll pull, get that leg to come. This right knee comes down at the same time as this arm swoops around. Head in. Grab a lock, preferably bottom hand on top. Just so if you try feeling it, try feeling that it's, you know what I mean? But if you try going this way, that locks in. So bottom hand on top, and then we're pushing it with our head, dragging up his foot to get his pressure. 